time to play the game we call We're Just Curious. Spin the wheel. Everybody tilts their head to the right. I don't think Mike watches anymore because Mike used to email us and now he doesn't. Hey, Mike. My feelings are hurt. Mike, if you're watching, just send an email that says hi. <laughs> what? What music artist or group appears the most in your phone? Oh, okay, this is a no brainer. I'm gonna, we'll go for it. No, go ahead. I was gonna say for me, Drake mm -hmm. seems to appear the most, but yes. right now, Beyonce. <laughs> oh, yeah, the past Everybody two days, watching that Netflix special, oh my God. in mean, case you're wondering why. Yeah, well, I listen to Beyonce regularly, so yeah. she pops up a lot. I have every album, but yeah. she just. Um, yeah, she's just so good. I mean, she really is. I'm going to say just like in a genre in general, yeah. just like country music. Really? Yeah. I actually didn't, I wouldn't have thought that with you. Oh, really? I so my new thing first. is, okay, well, I've just been on a real big country <laughs> kick. Once the sun comes out, I'm just like country all the way. Okay. But like Spotify, they have a thing like new music on Fridays. I like to do that too. Oh. Yeah. All country. No, no, no. It's oh, just, just like, like it's like a, okay, yeah. okay. Also, um, we should let you guys know that we are going to have a spring playlist for you. Yeah. We have curated a playlist just for you mm -hmm. with our favorite songs. It's going to be good, too. Yes. Okay, let's see who else is playing along. Angel. Hey, good morning, my friends. You know what? Uh, the, that's funny. Funny we asked this question because the last week it has been... Rick James and the Gap Band. Oh, just Rick nice. James and the Gap Band. Yeah, yeah. Just switched it up. Switched it up this week. Okay, Alan. Um, it's going to be two things. Uh, one, I'm into Boston from like the 70s and 80s, and of course, the Backstreet Boys. Hello, of I was just there. I was <laughs> well, once, you, once you have the Howdy. baby, it's going to be We're kid ball. I know. That's all you're going to be listening to. Also, new rule yeah. for Alan. <laughs> yeah. For the question of the day, you are only allowed one answer because every time you're like, okay, two okay. answers. You're, from here on out, if you answer <laughs> twice, you're not included okay. anymore. Got it? And Alan, you know she'll hold you to it. <laughs> Don't you dare come with two. Not even one and a half. <laughs> now, Michael Marsh, if you want to come with two, it's okay because we don't get to see you very often. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So let's see. Uh, what do you think my number one would be? The oldies. Just, just give it. You listen Sweet to Clementine. Neil Diamond. Neil Diamond all day, every day. Oh, my God. He, he should play, if he's still here, we should have him do tunes. You know Michael is a favorite in my family. When my Grammy hears that you're also a Neil Diamond fan, just shut it down. <laughs> just shut it down. She's only watching the show for you now, Michael. She doesn't even yes. care that her granddaughter's on TV. Uh, Neil man. Diamond. Gotta love him. Only one answer? Okay. Feel free to tweet your answer and tag us at Good Day Sacramento so we can see. You can also put hashtag DDS. Just curious. A rare meeting.